The Fall and Rise of Pakistan's Space Ambitions Pakistan's space ambitions started strong, launching its first rocket in 1962, becoming the third state in Asia to do so. However, today, there is no comparison between Pakistan's space organization, Suparco, and India's ISRO. Political will and a conducive environment are necessary for progress in science and technology. Suparco was established in 1961, and with Pakistan's alliance with the United States, it became a convenient option for collaboration in the Indian Ocean. Pakistan launched its first rocket, Rebar-1, in 1962, studying the wind structures of the Earth's upper atmosphere. Suparco expanded into satellite technology, establishing its remote sensing research group. Pakistan became a participating member of international space committees and collaborated with NASA, the UK's National Space Centre, and the European Space Agency. Pakistan's relations with China grew, leading to the launch of its first experimental satellite, Badr-1, in 1990. However, budget cuts and diminished ambitions in space hindered Suparco's progress. U.S. sanctions in 1993 further limited Pakistan's achievements. India's ISRO dominates space operations in South Asia, posing challenges to Pakistan's security interests. ISRO's technological superiority allows it to keep an eye on Pakistan's strategic moves. India's satellites serve as an early warning system and its missile capabilities create a strategic dilemma for Pakistan. Pakistan launched its communications satellite, Paksat-1R, in 2011, aided by China. The Space Vision 2047 outlines Pakistan's plans to launch a total of six GEO satellites and five LEO satellites. China's support and the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor have stabilized Pakistan's space program. Pakistan is making progress in the space arena, but it needs proper domestic laws and public interests to fully benefit from the growing commercial space industry. The government should encourage research and space exploration and involve the general public in the space industry.